My name is Raina, and this is my aha moment. I was raised very conservative in a Jehovah's Witness family, and I've always known since a very young age that I was a lesbian. And the events that took turn in my life living in a conservative community uh, had a big emotional toll on me and never really got over it in my young adult age and finally just broke down, couldn't handle it anymore. I went through about six years of emotional healing, and now that I've come to a crossroads where I'm finally in a better place, I want to contribute back to the community. As of January, I became the youth director for the Center for Equality, and I'm, I set up a group called Rainbow Nation, and uh, we set up family takeovers and uh, youth takeovers. We do things like Youth Pride or Halloween Party, and just set up an actual community where LGBT kids and their allies can just get together in a safe environment and just be themselves. If it had not been for the Center for Equality when I was 16 years old, having youth groups for two hours on the third Saturdays of the month, I would have been another suicide statistic. The fact that I can turn around and give back that very thing to my own community and offer the type of sanctity that I had that saved my life, if I can just save one life, I think everything I'm doing with the Center is worth it. We owe it to each other as human beings to show love and understand the humanity inside people. Love can heal any type of wound. That doesn't mean forgetting what you've been through. It means finding something that gets you through it, finding a meaning inside of it. Not only learning from it, but trying to help others learn from it and encourage everyone around you to seek love and to find love in themselves. You can't love others if you don't love yourself first.